Yo, what's up? It's your boy AJ Jackson once again reporting live for Label Networks Television. We're hanging out at the Pool Trade Show office. We got the uh, skin grab design in the house tonight, burning up the runway. A little bit of a uh, couture swankiness going on. Some real underground cut, cut, cut. So uh, let's check them out and see what's burning up on the runway. Come on now. Yo, what's up? Once again, what did I tell you? That is some serious, serious couture Mac Daddy fashion show going on here, man. Let me tell you, the gowns, unbelievable. The embellishments, outrageous. The hair, straight. I don't know what else to say besides what a beautiful fashion show that was. So this is your boy AJ Jackson once again, man, reporting live for Label Networks Television. And uh, Skin Graph is in the house. Stick around, man. We're going to go interview the designers. Hot, 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 unbelievable, blowing up the runway. Let's talk about some couture, swanky, swanky couture. That's right. I got my man Johnny right here and Cassidy over here with beautiful Donna in the middle right now. And we're going to talk to these guys about the line. Yo, talk to me about Skin Grab, man. Where did it start? Uh, it started on the uh, living room floor. Little scraps of leather sewing together. We didn't have enough money to do much, and uh, it slowly built into something really epic, you know? It's just like the style is like a whole bunch of different pieces thrown together, like painted, thrashed, but then refined and beautified. And stuff like I mean, I, I want to emphasize on the word thrash because that was a thrashing show. I mean, it was just like 
fashion on the next level of Los Angeles. So talk to me a little bit more about like you, you not not just your inspirations, but where are you guys going with this? Everywhere. Where I mean, it's it's a, it was, we're creating like our, our dream world. You know, the things that we see and uh, just kind of manifesting them into these these beautiful images of women and men, and they're their own characters. And you know, it's it's, it's as far as it can go. You know, it's amazing, Cassidy, because like the opening, the opening shot with the cross gender and the whole, I mean, blew my mind, man. I'd love to see more of that kind of stuff on the runway. Like, you know, where are you from and what continue to inspire you? Um, I guess I'm, just, I'm really inspired by um, superheroes <laughs> and storybooks, you know, fairy tales, fantasy. I'm really inspired about how that relates to the reality of where we are, you know, this kind of idea of a dream and like a... The, the dream of the future, you know, and how that all interplays. So I really like to look at what's what's possible, you know, what we could be, you know, where, um, yeah, where we are now. When you came out for your intro, like your outro, like, you know, to bow, and you saw all these people clapping and just going absolutely nuts, man, what did that feel like? Well, it felt great. You know, we've done some shows before, but they've been very underground, you know, underground, like, you know, scenes, and so to have such a mainstream fashion, you know, crowd be so stoked by it is really, it was really awesome. It felt really good. So they call you the muse. What makes her the muse? You know, all of our pieces are created specifically for a specific model, a specific woman. You know, it's like we like harness like what they're all about, their energy, and because they are so fierce, you know, you need fierce women and men to wear these kind of outfits, and they really are our inspiration when we're making these things. We're not just looking for traditional models, like we're really looking for characters that embody, you know, what we're all about. You know, a powerful presence. You know, somebody who's up to things in the world. Somebody who's doing something. So we don't, we don't, we don't necessarily go through traditional model agencies. You know, we really find people that inspire us, and we create things for them, pretty much. Once again, this is your boy AJ Jackson reporting live here in Silver Lake, California, with Skin Graph hot on the runway. Okay, here we are reporting backstage live here at the Skin Graph show, and I got Marisa Yielding here with all that beautiful jewelry that we saw in these amazing models. You were amazing with that jewelry tonight, girl. <laughs> Let me tell you, when I saw, the, I mean, the, the ladies, boom. When I saw the guys come out and it was just skin and jewelry, it blew my mind. Yeah, that was hot. The hair pieces were just like amazing. Like, come on, talk to me about your line. Well, um, I've been doing jewelry for probably about 20 years, believe it or not. And I started, um, you know, I'm a bead worker. And I use semi-precious stones and um, just all kinds of things, antiques and different things to put together these like crazy headdresses that you can see. It's all chain work and bead work and stones. And um, here's another one over here. So I do the headdresses and body harnesses, necklaces. Um, you know, I really love Jonathan and Cassidy's work. They rock. Uh, we we collaborate well together. Our styles suit each other and uh, it's really fun so I'm totally happy to be here we had a great show tonight for me it's like I, I like to use old bits of jewelry and so I, I like I like to take pieces from the past and create designs that you would see maybe being worn in the future and then just bring it into the present moment to create this like just beautiful dream of the world right now to put some positive stuff out into the world you know because God the news is not great these days so you know, here, here's some magic. Have a big bite of magic. Well, I just want to say congratulations once again. You guys did an amazing job out here. The collaborations between the models, the collaboration between the uh, the jewelry designers, hair. the hair, the, the clothing. I mean, it was just an amazing show to watch and be participating with. So on that note, once again, this is your boy AJ Jackson reporting live. If you want some good jewelry, you better step on in here and get it. <laughs>